Ganon does get vastly outranged by Shulk. Yeah. It, I, I, I'm not sure how much it matters just for the way Biggie Cheese plays the game. He's such a gambly player where he's just like constantly throwing out the 50-50 smashes on the tech chase scenarios. But he did a lot of like run up, turn around, forward tilt. Like what? Who does that? This man is nuts. Right. Biggie Cheese also one of the better parriers I've seen in this game. He gets so much off of parries. There's but definitely a lot of room to, to land uh, parry combos. As speed punishes is control. going to be hard for Biggie Cheese to deal with oh because the speed art will allow Shulk to get so close in. I, I wonder if Carl's has the game plan of using shield to kind of walk in and then just canceling the shield art once you're through the projectile wall. Ooh, that is actually not a bad idea. I'm curious. I mean, you can, uh, you can buffer those dial switches. So that's one of those things where I'd love to see what Shulk has on lock for his dial switches. Wow, jump art just going straight back to the stage. Who needs a ledge? And this is a scary situation for Biggie Cheese. He's cornered, oh, but able to reverse it quite quickly. Yeah, a lot of times against Biggie Cheese, I, I think there's a little bit of matchup unfamiliarity where people just don't fully understand what Belmont does. But like you said at the beginning, Carls knows this character. He plays this character. It is definitely, I'll, I will say, it's definitely a friendlies Belmont. Every time I play against Carls uh, Belmont in friendlies, he suicides at least once per match. So, <laughs> I mean, listen. I play Belmont pretty regularly, and I suicide at least once per match. Like, this is a weird character, but I love him. Wow. Axe is going to kill there. I guess at 150, you do expect it to get the job done. Oh, Carl's able to set up some advantage. He oh. really has not gotten many follow-ups, though. Right there. Sh Shulk cheats, all right? You're, you're <laughs> here first, kids. Shulk cheats. Foot stool. Unable to get anything off of it, though. Uh, the Belmont forward tilt is so good. He's throwing it out there. That was five forward tilts in a row. What is happening? Uh, Carl, got to start mixing up the approaches. Landing at the exact same angle over and over and getting punched by that forward tilt. <sighs> Biggie Cheese makes the Belmont recovery look way better than it has any right to look. <laughs> I, you got to uh, work on those types of things <gasps> if you're going to play those Caught characters. him with the axe. He has shield. He's going to go nowhere. Yeah, that man went nowhere. Wow, this, this is, is this is home alone all over again. He went nowhere. He stayed right there. Yeah, full stock advantage here for Biggie Cheese and Carl Minet. Ooh. I like the idea, but unfortunately, spacing was not quite correct. That, that axe disappeared right before it would have hit him. Yeah. Carl's got so lucky. His life flashed before my eyes. Oh, yeah. oh OK. Really Walk, respecting the That man the just recovery. walked up and up smashed. Yeah, but just uh, ready for the ledge trap situation. So Carl's able to secure his first stock. But at 177, you got to figure that this one is not long for the world. Oh, just go for it. <gasps> yeah. Biggie. Oh, man. That I, was a big Big L, I guess. I don't know, man. I, I think he tried to jump and air dodge through after the first forward air, but unfortunately get, his jump gets caught, and then Carl lands a third forward oh, air. Forward smash. Gonna take it, though. Zero, zero, one stock apiece. I mean, Carl's got to be so happy with this. He was down like a full stock. Uh, but that's that's the Belmonts. The Belmonts have that, that uh, Little Mac problem where sometimes you just die. Yeah. <gasps> forward what tilt, two cross, two axe, two uppy. This man is insane. Dang. Was Shield Art not ready? It was available there when Carl just swapped speed. I wonder if he was uh, being a little disrespectful. You do not want to disrespect Biggie Cheese, or you will get disrespected yourself. I mean, he could have just been as surprised as we were. That was a wonky it's little true. string. <laughs> Those who disrespect must themselves be prepared to get disrespected. All right, forward tilt. He's, Carl's still got him trapped on the ledge here. Maybe a back throw. Yeah. Goes for the jump just to ensure he gets all the way back on stage. Okay, this has been the key to success. Shulk has not once jumped out in front of those forward air recoveries. Right. So I'm not sure if he can meet with jump art. He can come back from kind of wherever. Yeah. So it might be a good strategy to try to get in between the stage and that uh, aerial. Oh, he was looking to there, but very nice by Biggie Cheese to get the cross out to protect himself. Yeah, he and tried to again, do it there, but ate yeah. the cross. Oh, yeah. my God. He ended up behind Biggie Cheese because of the shield art. <laughs> I thought that was going to clip Carl's. Oh, I, thought I really thought that was going to clip Carl's. That was going to be it for Biggie Cheese. But Carl's, it's so high. 140. Oh, the air dodge. Wow. That is really unfortunate. Carl that was not waited just what a Carl little bit too long. Yeah, he was definitely looking to roll once he saw the holy water coming out. But it clipped him before he took the option. And then that it just buffered it in air dodge. Yeah, he so. directional air dodged. And that is all she wrote for game one. So Biggie Cheese up 1 0, which means I assume he will stay Belmont, which. 
Congratulations on him for the 1-0 lead, but I am sad to not see... <gasps> we got the dwarf. There is a Ganondorf in the house. Ladies and gentlemen, wow. prepare yourselves. Yeah, even after the win, I think that one stock where he got it, uh, edge guarded, Biggie was just like, you know, uh, not, not looking at... If you play it. a Belmont or a Little Mac or any of those kind of characters, you just sometimes have to be prepared to die whenever. Oh, oh boy, here we go. my goodness. But the mix is not real. You do get options to avoid it, so... That jab it hit from forever away. <laughs> that was like the, the wind off of his hand is what clips Carl's there. We're going to have to see. He's going for a lot of the, the command grab. So maybe maybe Carl's needs to figure out the adjustments to be. Yeah, ready. I think he has definitely caught on to a pattern of Carl's and is exploiting a little bit right now. That is both times on ledge. He has up aired off ledge. Oh, I'm curious no. to know if Carl's will pick up on that. Whiff grab, and then you know Shulk's gonna jump. So, <gasps> go. Oh, oh down air to grab. Did not get the follow up though. <gasps> Got the follow up, and it kills! Oh boy. Oh my goodness. He said, Doria, and get him out of here. Get this man out of here. Someone call this man a medic. He is dead. And Piggy Sheets just wins so many matchups, he has no right to have a shot in. Shulk, you know, all this range, and still. He's able to get in his face, and he's really just abusing Carl's. Oh. So I'm looking for a vision there. Might be the answer. You know he's going to throw out a move. My, you know. Listen, Biggie Cheese would not be Biggie Cheese if he didn't just throw out a move. <laughs> Both of them whipping grabs here. All right, smash art. Okay. Air Slash can definitely... Nope. Unable to space uh, it Biggie out properly. Biggie Cheese so smart on these recoveries. Oh, he man. lived. Yeah, I don't know how the air slash didn't pick him up. If it did, it Oh! You read that tech in place, and that's going to be it on game one. Biggie, was that a three stock? That was a three stock. Game two. We had a Belmont game one. Yeah, three <laughs> stock game two. Three stock game two. So here we are. Yeah. And I think the crowd is probably getting to Carl's. You know, not, like I said, he has become a little bit of a villain in the Columbus scene, but... Well, what's there's, funny is this crowd This crowd is Indiana and Cincinnati right now. Right. A lot of Columbus <laughs> went home and or is playing friendlies right now. Whereas the people who are kind of stuck here because their carpool is here, because they're in Sai's car and he's commentating next, they just got to kind of hold that. And this feels like an away crowd for Columbus right now. This is very much so a Cincinnati crowd. Oh, man. He's just getting caught. You hate to see it. Ganon never, with one of the worst, like, run speeds, very little uh, aerial drift. So, you know, Carl should really be able to take more advantage of the movement advantage that he has. But You know, I never get tired of how satisfying it is to hear Ganondorf land moves. <laughs> the amount of base this man has, like, it is. He in here. It's like Jax in Mortal Kombat. Oh, my goodness. I Jax is so satisfying in Mortal Kombat. The Kunk Kunk is uh, it's something to enjoy. Oh, I was about to say, speaking of Kung Kung, eat that Doria. I kind of feel like every game against Biggie Cheese with Ganondorf, somebody gets hit by one random forward smash. Like you're kind of destined to just lose a stock against a random forward smash. All right. Carl's not going to be one to fall prey to the up tilt. Yeah, you know, he throws out the up tilt a lot in edge guards, and I've never seen him hit it, so I don't know what he's looking for. Oh, he, he definitely hit it against Mysteria, so. Yeah, so he did hit it against Mysteria Cup. Oh boy, Carl's a little too far away there. He's getting some uh, some kind of bad DI situations. At least that's what it looks like to me. Got to clean up those recoveries. Oh, that was a really nice neutral air there from Shulk. Something that I don't see enough Shulk players really abuse is Shulk's range. Shulk, Shulk has so much range, and a lot of times Shulk players don't really use it very much. It's kind of hard. Uh, he actually has really terrible aerial drift. Uh, so he moves fast, but you're super committed to the spacing once you uh, press the jump. There we go. So it can be hard to like get the, the perfect tipper range on stuff. But Also, seeing Ganondorf run at that platform was moving made him look like he had his own speed art on. That up man was zooming across the uh, stage. Up air, but not able to follow up. All right, big opportunity here for Carl's. Oh, he gets nothing, though. Spot dodge avoids the grab, and once again, Biggie Cheese taking it to him. This is kind of a blowout. And that, that's it. That confirms. That is it. Full blowout. <laughs> he put his hands on that man. He put his hands all over him. Oh, 
Carl's. That's game. That's really disappointing. I know he, um, you know, after having a really rough cost, he was hoping to uh, make it a little bit deeper in bracket at this event. I definitely ninth place though. Yeah, ninth is Good nothing to, to scoff at. Yeah.